because we're so used to seeing that thing packed. Of course, Ilya Illich, Eugene Sterikoff both miss some extended time opportunity here in Kelly. Blasted after a takeaway, after a solid playing career, whose final stop was in Indy last Dangerous year. Dangerous ball. Yes, it was, and it went right to Evan Newton. Pasher surges forward. The lead for Connor. Couldn't keep it on frame. Jackson goes to the turf Ooh. and draws a foul. Yeah, that's, that's unfortunate. I, I agree with Patty on that. I think, but I'd be surprised if anybody other than 19 takes this one. Yeah, I think that that's some confusion. That's probably oh. the deflection, and it finds its way in. And it wasn't Enzo Martinez. It was a left foot, and for just the second time this year, the Indy 11 trail in this. Well, it wasn't Jackson, it's on King, although I think it deflected off of Jackson, yes. So it has been transferred to FC Cincinnati. More in a moment. Pasher, they can try and get that left foot. Draws three defenders. Pass the fourth. Shot past what the fifth. Save. And Miller oh. keeps this game one goal to Charlotte's My advantage. Goodness. Watch the championship live every week. Sign oh. up today, ESPNplus.com. What a ball and what a run. Connor at Miller. Spilled the rebound for a moment, but collects it quickly in front of Dane Kelly. Final five minutes plus stoppage time in the first half. Brought to us by your Central Indiana Honda Dealers. Official automotive sponsor of the 11. Iose sends it in, made its way back post. Wemet flicks it down, and Carl Wemet gets the goal. His first of the season, and how about the two defenders combined to provide the goal. We'll come out, we'll fight with our normal game plan. Great job by Hackshaw just to keep it in. And Womet buries it after Carl had three goals a season ago. His first this year. And we're all tied up at one. That's just how you draw up that restart. Bounce it in the six. Finds Farias. Does track it down in time. Slides it through oh. the pasher. He whiffs. Illich's shot. Didn't really hit the fastball that time. What a foul! Wow. Hi, Jose. Jose plays it across, looking back post. Illich, bicycle. Oh my goodness. Bye. <laughs> Flag stays down. Goal in the 11. Drew Connor in his second in the 11 game gets his first in the 11 goal. <laughs> Illich keeps it alive. Barrett puts it on that target. Is ridiculous. And the sitter from Connor. That was a great shot on frame. And it was Oduro that kept him on side. Oduro was kind of out of the play along the end line. This is not my home. I thought not, you had close. a shot collar on, and every time you got close to the door, you'd be called back. Kelly, blast with a good hit. Foot. Only two goals this year from outside of the 18 for the Indy 11. Kelly nearly had a third. Wherever you go, take the boys in blue with you. Whoa. Now, and how about that? <laughs> That's unbelievable. A miscue <laughs> leads to a freebie for the Indy 11. And a third goal for a second time in as many meetings with the Independents this year. Miller rolls it out. And literally directs it off of Drew Cotter. What are the chances? What are the chances? And Drew Cotter in his second game with the Indy 11, has the most unlikely of braces. Pasher now provides some breathing space. Well, I tell you, I think everybody took a look and you saw Herrera just hanging out. There's Rodriguez. Let's see it. 1v1, left foot lines it up, takes a deflection. And this one's over. No need for further action. The Indy 11 scored the last three. Two of them belonging to Drew Connor. 